Danger at the door. Cameras catching a suspected carjacker desperately trying to hide from police moments after taking off with a toddler in the back seat. Local 10's Madeline Wright leads off this midday with this exclusive. Madeline. Janice Gio, it was a strange and scary turn of events. The clerk here at Chevron tells me that a woman walked in wanting to buy one of these BC fast acting pain relief powder sticks and moments before she went in, a guy came in claiming that he was waiting for his Uber. Well, as soon as the lady walked in, the guy who was waiting for Uber saw that she had apparently left her keys in the car with the engine running and he took off in her vehicle. But within the last five minutes, we have learned that suspect was arrested at 10 o'clock this morning and is now being charged with grand theft. Gas station surveillance video shows a man in a Charlotte Hornets jersey leaving the Chevron on West Sunrise Boulevard, then jumping into a woman's car with her two-year-old daughter in the back seat. <laughs> surveillance video you'll only see on Local 10 News shows what appears to be the same carjacking suspect knocking and turning the doorknob at a woman's apartment moments after he bailed out of the stolen vehicle. When the woman opens the door, he claims he's the victim. She closes the door and the suspect walks away. It's unknown if she ever called police. The carjacking took place around 2 o'clock yesterday afternoon. The mother almost got run over as she tried to stop him from kidnapping her child. She flagged down a stranger for help. Well, she ran, I wanted to win, and I was like, what happened? She was like, somebody just stole my car and my baby in it. I was like, your baby? Demary and Hudson agreed to give her a ride so they could chase the suspect down. They pursued the car to this neighborhood about a mile away, where the suspect abandoned the vehicle at the end of a dead-end street. The toddler was still inside. Right when we had got to the car, like the car was like, the car seat was flipped over, the baby was under the car seat, crying, I'm like, whoa. And back live at Chevron, it's very loud because there's a car wash right next to me. It was a dangerous ride. The Good Samaritan says that the carjacking suspect sw sideswiped his vehicle and hit a bus as he was trying to escape. But he says that all that matters is that two-year-old girl was found safe and has been reunited with her mother. Live in Fort Lauderdale, Madeline Wright, Local 10 News.